Members of the Amarillo Tea Party Patriots were thrilled to welcome their guest speaker, Michael Sullivan, the president of Empower Texans. He was in the middle of the legislative session and people that he works with were there. And so uh, we're all curious to see what actually transpired there, who um, submitted the bills, which ones were vetoed, which ones affected us here locally, um, depending on if they're gas and oil bills and those things that actually affect the Texas Panhandle and the citizens here. Their mission is to ultimately educate the public on what is going on within the government. We actually like the people to uh, come to the meetings, be informed, listen for themselves and make their own decisions to see if the individuals that we bring in, sometimes we have candidate forums, are um, they can make the choice themselves, unlike um, government and some other groups. I don't have to tell them what they need to believe in. They can dis decide for themselves once they've actually met and visited with those people. With Sullivan's inside knowledge, he was able to tell locals what was discussed. According to the Texas Public Policy Foundation, the Wall Street Journal, we've had a 26 percent increase in state spending this session to last session. Um, unfortunately, I'm in very much in the way of budget reforms to ensure that our dollars are being well used and appropriately used. One of the most interesting things Sullivan said he discovered while in Austin was that 94 percent of Republican voters had agreed on wanting stricter constitutional spending limits. You know, you can't get 94% of Republicans to agree on what color the sky is. And yet 94% of Republican voters say they want strict constitutional spending limits, and yet the Republican-controlled legislature refused to even take up that kind of question. Those are the kind of things that we should be asking, um, asking our elected officials about. Sullivan stressed the fact that ultimately the most things citizens can do to reshape their area is to remember that they are actually in control and that the elected officials work for them. Chanel Douglas, Pro News 7.